It's late in the day and I just want to bring you up to speed. This is a feature I call the Everyday EMS Tips Mailbag. It's stuff that's uh, been mailed to me recently. Products, training aids, all sorts of stuff I just want to share with you. Uh, first of all, uh, EpiPen. This is an EpiPen trainer. There's a new type out. Um, and this is a trainer, but you just remove the blue cap and then you'd press this orange tip against the patient's the lateral aspect of their thigh as explained and I'm just gonna take it off camera here maybe you heard it click but when you withdraw this thing this orange so you press it and then orange so the needle actually would be sheathed in there so this trainer I got this by going to epipen.com and they've got training educator resources they also sent me this video you can find if you go there the how to use the new EpiPen. Another auto injector uh, training device, the Duodote a auto injector trainer. Now you know this is for orga organophosphate exposure. I should have probably looked this up just so I get it right, but you could look up Duodote. The medication in here, 2PAM and atropine. I should know this off the top of my head, but let's say it's 2PAM and atropine. Duodote auto injector trainer, a little pocket card. Um, if I got that wrong, you write in the comments and tell me what it is. And then uh, from Morgan Lens, this is the uh, product that you use if somebody's got uh, irritant in their eye to irrigate the eye. And this is a pretty slick device as well. So here's a trainer that they sent me. And uh, so you got something that looks like an eye and then a Morgan lens and this you'd hook up to your IV fluids and then you'd follow the instructions to start floating, uh, flow in fluid and then float this thing onto the eye. But this came from Morgan lens and Mortran. If you go to morganlens.com you'll see instructions on how to work this thing and how the Morgan lens works. But this, I got this because uh, the new scope of practice for paramedics includes using the Morgan lens. So I'm putting together some training content related to that. So that's uh, th three things in the mailbag. And then the fourth thing, I got uh, three of these from EKG Concepts. This is a pretty neat tool. It's the RCAT window for STEMI. So, if you had a 12 lead, which I've got right over here, you would just hold this over and it's going to not show you so well, but you'd line up that red line on your isoelectric line and then use that to look for ST elevation or depression. Pretty handy that there's, um, you know, pictures here and then also where that ischemia might be happening, tools to measure. Um, it looks like uh, time and seconds intervals, but this is from ekgconcepts.com. I want you to go to their website and check this out. They've got a bunch of other tools that are really fantastic related to learning how to read 12 leads as well as regular dysrhythmia interpretation. So this is the RCAT window for STEMI from ekgconcepts.com, morganlens.com, duodo dot com and epipen.com so that's what was in the mailbag for february for everyday ems tips